Love Nikki just announced our next event. Get ready for another Dawn battle to get these cute uh, mouse and cat suits. But wait, we just had a Dawn front less than two months ago. Well, that's because Love Nikki is legit running out of events to give us. We have seven more Diamond Synco events to go. Then we will be all caught up to a server that is two years ahead of us and still, for some reason, are missing 70 free suits. Hmm. Anyway, if you participated in the last Dawn front and won, listen carefully. Just pick the same guy you picked last time because the lineup is the exact same as last Dawn front. Uh, these are the boys that you can pick. No shade yet again, but we in Night Order proof that we are even stronger without shade with a perfect 3 of 3 of victory. I picked a Team Zoo last time. I think I'm going to pick Team Reed this time time because I have not picked Reed before. Now, if you were on the losing team, look, I care about your diamonds. Pick Night Order if you like to save diamonds on um, Dawn front suits. Like even if you don't like the cat and mouse suit this time, do it for the past and present Dawn front suits then. Night Order has won 8 times in a row and I don't see that changing anytime soon. Now I'm going to show you these cat and mouse suits in a sec, but I want to talk about our anniversary Hell event too, which is quite overdue. I want to revisit this Facebook post that Love Nikki made because I had thought they said the anniversary hell event was next. Uh, maybe I misunderstood them. Uh, let's see. So over here, the question too: Why are there only anniversary community events but no in-game events and related welfare events? And they answered: This year's anniversary celebration consists of two phases. A uh, phase one from April 20th to early May, the community will launch a series of uh, community events with rich rewards to help stylists accumulate in-game resources. So the phase one. They were talking about the Facebook web events, like 1,000 players enter, 10 players win, those sort of things. I used to enter these events, but I stopped to give other players a chance to win. I figure there are others more in need of the 200 diamonds. The phase one should be over now. Phase two. It says, in early May, the in-game features and regular content will be updated. The anniversary hell event and related welfare events will open afterwards. This is the part where there is a misunderstanding because when they say early May, I thought early May already happened. I thought phase two already started. Anyone else thought that? Because I thought that phase two started with the release of the cannon girl. Am I right or am I wrong? And that cannon girl was the regular content that was updated, right? So does that mean the hell event is going to be after the dawn front or is it going to be running at the same time as the dawn front? Um, oh gosh, I'm getting very nervous now. I guess we'll find out tomorrow then and then I'll make a update a video. I don't know, I'm just so confused by Momo. Anyway, let me show you our uh, two uh, brand new suits, the cat and the mouse. Let's do the mouse first. Oh, by the way, cost. If you want a one suit, that's going to be like 800-ish. It's actually going to be different for everyone depending on a lot of things. Like if you're on the winning or losing team, if you have event currency saved up from last time, that's going to be cheaper for you. And if you want both suits, it's going to be roughly a 2,500 diamonds, which is a a very good price for two suits. Now, break down. First up, we have the mouse hair. We have this uh, mouse dress. We have this mouse uh, cape. We have the Chris Crocs uh, socks. And here are the shoes. Cheese hat. Oh, man. I love cheese. And then here's lemon. Oh, this is a uh, lemon. Yeah, this is a cheese suit with a little bit of lemon here. And then here's a cheese in the mouth. And then we have a cheese uh, waist item. We have a cheesy tail. And then we have this uh, bag of bread and apples. This is the ratatouille suit. And then here is the ratatouille uh, running away suit. Uh, every Thing is a match to get her into this uh, dress pose. Uh, let's go into the view room because we have this cute little mousy. Oh my gosh! So uh, a mousy uh, ended up finding himself inside the cheese with uh, flying lemons. Yeah, and then over here we have a cute little um, mouse escorting uh, some mustard on 
the lemon. I'm not sure about the recipe here, but yeah, mustard and lemon. And that is going to be your kawaii mouse suits. The cat suit. Oh my gosh. I, 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 I love the cat suit. I'm sorry to the mouse suit, but I, I, I'm such a cat fan. There she is. This is the original pose. Cat on the hat, cat on the bag, a cat teacup, and cat on the boots. Here is the hair. Here is the separate top as well as the separate bottom. Here's how the top bottom looks like. And then here is the uh, socks. Here's the shoes. And then here is this. Oh, <laughs> so cute. And then here's the uh, ribbon on the neck. Here is a, a kitty sleeping in the purse. Here is a, a kitty a teacup, uh, gloves, and a, a fluffy a tail. Special pose looks like this. Everything mashed together into this one dress pose. Let's see how it looks like in the view room. And then, oh my gosh, the uh, bonus background pieces. Oh, I, 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 I can't. I can't look, look at the tall beans on the ice cube. Oh my goodness. And over here, there's, there's another uh, teacup with, with the cat ears lid. So, so, so adorable. 